Hello, oh, welcome back to Final Fantasy VI. My name is Usser. Uh, oh, hey, why? Why are we not? What? There we go. Okay, now we're back at it. Now we're back at it. We need to get rid of those spikes. Get rid of the spikes and move our way through this cave towards the legendary dragon. Ugh. Ugh. Those faces are just so annoying with their thousand needle bullshit. Jump across the lava. I can't remember which one I need to do. Uh, I think it's this one. Yes, that went to a treasure chest, which would be empty. Aha! And now we have put out the lava. Which is good, because the way forward requires us to go down there. Level up for Umaro. I don't know why they have him with magic points. That's that's always been kind of an odd one, because... Even when he has the ability to do Snowstorm, he doesn't use magic points. So it's kind of like a... Curious, odd thing. Okay, so Midgard Somer has Quake, Graviga, and Tornado. All of those, like uh, Graviga and Tornado, will drop your HP really low, but it won't kill something. Quake only works on things that are um, not flying. So anything flying, like these guys I think all count as flying monsters, would not be hurt. Okay, up and around and down. Now. Uh, I can't remember which way I'm supposed to go. Cyan learned Eclipse. Oh, we got a new one. Nice. Also, is he done gaining magic points yet? No, not quite. Ugh. What about you? Nope. Uh, I need to change Sabin's Esper. Forgot about the poison. Don't want to hurt myself. Okay, this is the way to go. Boing, boing. Alright, let's go knock that one down. Boom. Now, I can't get back to a save point, so I'm gonna have to be careful about this. I'm not even... no. Nope. No, nope, not gonna deal with these faces. Okay, let's be careful not to engage him too quick, because I want this! Oh, Dragon Horn. I thought that was gonna be a flame shield for some reason. Crystal, diamond, ice, not gonna be that useful. Uh, did I get a flame shield in here? I did not. Okay. Ah, good. I can quick save it, though. Kind of stuck. And he might just have come up that ladder, too. That was a bad quick save. Now I'm going to count on the Phantom Rush damage mixed with um, everybody else just kind of contributing a little. Because this won't be a tough fight, Legendary Dragon! But it's mainly going to be Sabin. I've only got one, let's hope this works. Quick save. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. We got him. That was the important part, was getting him. I'm good with this. 
Murakumo. Six dragons remaining. Equip with the Murakumo. Wow! Attack 199, an ancient Doman blade that was lost during the War of the Magi. Okay, so here's the thing. I can't res anybody, because I'm out of Phoenix Downs. And I don't have the raise spell. So, you guys hang out there. I'll, I'll uh, talk to you later. <laughs> uh, Gal level up. Mog level up. Lock! You're all safe. Look, I finally found it. The legendary treasure that can undo death itself. Is that Magicite? It is. Legend has it that the phoenix turned itself to stone ages ago. It seemed the story was true. Now it's filled with cracks. I don't know if it has the strength to perform miracles. Rachel, I failed her. I broke my promise and lost the only thing that was real to me. So until I do what I said I'd do, until I restore my honor, I'm nothing but a no-good liar. So you're headed to Kolingan? Yes. The village of Kolingan. By the way, I have no idea if I'm saying that right. I'm guessing here. Magicite. Well, do something, Phoenix. If it didn't have all those nasty cracks, don't think it's going to be calling back any wayward spirits like that. Nope. Uh uh. Too bad, really. Too bad. Ah, the Magicite shattered! Lock? Rachel! Lock, oh how I've wanted to see you, to talk to you. Rachel. Phoenix used the last of its power to give me some time, but I must leave again soon. Before my time's gone, there's something I must tell you, something I never had a chance to say. Lock, you made me so happy. My last moments, my memory returned. I drifted off thinking of you, and I was truly, truly happy. So let me now say the words I never had the chance to say, Lock. Thank you. Nah, I love you. Rachel? I have to go now. Thank you so much for all the happiness you've given me. Please, cut free the chains that bind your heart. Give your love to one who has that place within your heart now. Love her as you love me. Phoenix, be reborn and give your power to Locke. Rachel! Those visual effects have changed. Lock. I'm all right. Rachel put my heart at ease. From here on out, everything will be okay. Let's go. We've got a job to do. What is it?
Your guess is as good as mine, Celis. X Potion, Phoenix Down, X Either, Elixir, Flame Shield, Valiant Knife. Those are all the treasures from the Phoenix Cave. Alright, let's get going. I think we've kept Kefa waiting long enough. Yeah, yeah, about that. No. No. Uh, I better equip Locke before I run out and get into, like, a random fight. Yeah, because you gotta walk a little ways. And I've gotten into random fights before and had to run away. Okay, so we need Locke because he's going to, well, pick locks. Um, I also need Edgar because I need to go buy some stuff. Uh, change party members. Yes! Uh, we're still taking Umaro. Uh, still gonna take Gal. And we'll take Edgar and Locke. Okay, give me a minute to equip everybody. That'll be good for now. I mean, we will have money for different weapons and armor. So that's good, but not as much as I'd hoped. And in fact, uh, I need to go to the auction house at some point because they have two espers that, um, two pieces of magicite you can buy. All right, let's go to Narsh. There's something we really, really need here. And then we will continue finding people to add to our party. Okay, there we are, the weapon shop. This is the only guy left in town. And Locke, of course, can pick all the locks. All the other houses are empty. But for some reason, this guy stuck around. Been waiting for you. I wanted to give you this. Magicite. I ran a weapon shop for 70 years, but I've never felt a power like the one I feel in this stone. If I were to grind it down into the shape of a blade, I'm sure it would make a very powerful weapon. What do you say? Shall I make a sword out of it? Leave it as the magicite. Alright. And I'm immediately equipping that. Um, I'll just equip it on Gao. Uh, Esper's... Ragnarok teaches the Ultima spell, and once you get the Ultima spell on everybody, you've broken the game. Period. It's an AoE, it's one of the highest damaging spells in the game, it's incredible. So, let's start breaking the game. These guys aren't so tough anymore. Alright, I think we should go to... Hmm... I actually, I have an idea. Before we go to Gidor, where the auction house is, and get another person for our party, we're gonna come over here. I've, I've got my fingers crossed. I've been learning a lot of spells with Gao. Um, magic. Float. Save the game. In we go. We've got another legendary dragon to slay. Stop it. There's a dragon sitting smack in the middle of my stage. What'll I do? That's all he says. So then I've got to save the day again. Hi. Don't touch the wrong switch or you'll be in for a nasty surprise. I think it's three. Yeah. Why do they even have that switch? Wrong lever! Do do. So, this guy can attack us. He cannot use his earth attacks on us. Because we're floating. Oh! That was quick. I did not remember he had that Hone Tusk attack. Now the landslide won't work, because we're floating.
Well, good thing I got Phoenix Downs, huh? Okay, they are no longer floating. Um, magic, you're uh. All right, so we'll let Gal be a healer. Everybody else can work on doing some damage. That one might, that might do it. Yep. Well, this is going terribly. I thought float would work, so um, it really is a case that I'm going to need to equip Gaia gear for everybody. I really want to steal from him. Man! Okay, so we gotta rely on Gal being healed and uh, doing Cat Scratch now to finish this off. And probably dodging that. Nope. Okay. I I'm too low level, clearly. Never mind. Yeah, I remember doing that earlier on. I don't think the Hone Tusk hit as hard um, in the previous versions. I could be wrong, but I remember that was the first dragon I usually did because the Gaia gear means he can't hurt you. So, we're going to go get Realm. And since I'm here, I might roll my roll the dice at the auction house. It's pretty hit or miss on what they auction each time. And you have to like leave and come back in, which is kind of annoying. Ah! A fully robotic imp. You can't win this one. This or the little mini airship, you can't win. I kind of wish you could bid on that robotic imp, though, because there's like a set of armor and a weapon that's made specifically for an imp that makes them actually really damn strong. But you have to like give up on your character's special. So like, let's say you did it on Edgar, you'd no longer have tools, but you'd be immune to water and you'd have this really strong spear, really good defense. Okay, so. Stay away. This is Ozer's diary, read it. Just spent a small fortune on a new painting, the first in some time. It's quite a large one, so I won't be able to put it on the first floor with the others. Must think about where to display it. Yeah, I'm not gonna read it all. He bought a curse painting. And we want to talk to the pretty lady. And we get attacked. Oh, I'm floating still. Oh my god, I forgot. I need to use a tent because Gao has no... Or stay at an inn. Ugh. Gao has no magic points. Okay, hold on. Haha. <laughs> that opened the door. And we'll get to that door. But in a minute. Alright, in the door. Oh, it's dark down here. It's all dark and spooky. Okay, if you walk too close to this painting, you get sucked up into the chair and attacked. So that's why I walked around it as much as I did. Uh, I want the treasure. Oh. Well, I kind of do need to see everybody so I can have Gao learn them. Oh, I don't like these girls. They, um... Throw weapons, and it hits hard. They have a random assortment of them that they can throw. And it hurts. Nice to have potions again. A Moogle suit. That's for Realm or Strago. And when they are wearing it, they do look like a Moogle. And there's a Lich Ring hidden back there. I believe I want to go in the middle door. I'm wrong about that. I wanted to go in maybe the left door? Hmm. Haunted Mansion. Now, I could try and get each one of these treasure chests. Um, the thing is, is each one of them will uh, have a bot or a fight. So, oops. I'm gonna try and just move forward with some progress here.
I mean, it's good experience, it's good money, but... I already had a bit of a time waste on that legendary dragon. Let's get some progress. Stray Cat! A still life. Level up for tomorrow. Good for him. Yeah, okay. Save the game. We've got a boss fight coming up. And there's Ozer. I don't know why he looks like Jabba the Hutt in this. Please help the painting. The painting? There's a monster possessing my prize goddess painting. Monster? Yes, it hides in the painting. It won't show itself. Eek! Realm, you mustn't attack the picture of the goddess. It only makes matters worse. Wahaha. <laughs> Tried to get between me and my prize, will you? Painting's the best I've had in a long time. No one's denying me this treat. So, I need to not attack the goddess. Tomorrow's going to anyway. And, oh, here we go. It switches over, and now I kill. Cat scratch time. Yes! Nothing to steal. Damn. Boom, slam. Yes. I also believe it's weak against Thunder Magic, but I don't know if I have anybody who does a really good job with Thunder Magic. Uh, Thundara? I always had a problem with this when I was doing it on the previous ones, because I was under-leveled when I got here. You find it early on, like, you, you're right next to Jidor and Zozo, so I was like, yeah, let's see what's here, and... Yeah. I really needed a cat scratch there, buddy. Really did. On the plus side, he's not doing much damage to us. Oops. Yeah. No. What? Stop it, gal. You. You couldn't have. Yes, I could have. I'm awesome like that. I notice he didn't charm any of my people. He will charm them, um, and so they will get in the way of attacks on the painting. You can relax now, that monster's not going to be possessing any more paintings. Thank you, that picture is worth more than my own life. I mean, than my own life. Really? What was a monster doing in that painting? Guess I should start at the beginning. I've been looking at this lovely stone I bought at the auction house. All of a sudden, I was overcome with a desire for a painting of Lakshmi. Lakshmi? I had a few different artists try to paint it for me, but none of them really gave me what I was looking for. Right around that time, I heard about Lil Realm. I brought her here and straight here and set her to work. Then that thing came along and possessed her painting. It must have been lured by that stone. Where's the stone now? Stone, it's over in that bookcase. This is Magicite. Whatever it is, I sure don't need it anymore. If you want it, you can have it. I have to go now, but don't worry, I'll be back to finish this painting. I'll be waiting for you. Now we got Realm, which means we can immediately go get Strago. All we have to do is show up with Realm, and he snaps out of his funk and joins the party. The Lakshmi painting, or uh, painting, Magicite teaches you Kiraga. So it's a good one. Okay, off to the Cult of Kefka Tower. Yeah, he's got his own cult. Which is literally like a death cult because he wants to kill everything. And Strago's a part of it. Listen here, you stubborn old bag of bones. Snap out of it. <laughs> Realm? Realm, is it really you, dear? You're alive?
Grandpa, you idiot, what were you thinking? Realm, I was sure you were. You really think I was going to check out before you, you old geese bag? <laughs> Foul mouth as ever, I see. Bless your heart. Come on, Grandpa, you're coming along with us. Aha, I'm raring to go. Can't leave everything up to you whippersnappers, can I? Boom, two more people just like that. Boing, boing. Okay. I think I'll park my butt over at the auction house. I have a ton of grinding to do in this. A ton. So first of all, I've got to boost some levels. And there's a spot to do that. Where you can fight T-Rexes. I'm not sure if I'm strong enough. Then I've got more monsters to get for Gal. We've also got a bunch of backstory to do. Like, Cyan's got backstory at Doma Castle. Strago's got backstory at his hometown. Now that I have Locke and Celis, I should go down and see Sid. But we will get to that in the next one. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell so you can see whenever I post anything new. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Catch you all in the next one. Bye!